Welcome back. All right, no need to give up your favorite seasonal drinks this time of year. We're making a healthy version of pumpkin spice lattes, and we happen to have certified health coach Vivian Sickles joining us from 101010 10, 10 Coaching. How are you? Great. How are you doing? Hey, this is a big date for you that's approaching. It that is. is here. It was yesterday. It was, here. It was yesterday. It was yesterday. It, and so mm -hmm. that it's a very meaningful date for you. It is. Yes. October 10th. And you can explain why. Go ahead. Um, it was a big day. It was a big day in a couple different ways. But first of all, it's a big day because October 10th, 2010 is when I had a stroke and my whole life changed. And I know we've talked about this before. It's okay though, and I know and I know it's probably hard for you to it's, talk it's okay. about. It's okay. But I think it's always important for all those who are viewing mm -hmm. to know because when they yeah. hear it, I think it also inspires them. Good, good. Well, it certainly changed everything that I have done with my life. So um, I celebrate it. It could Good be, you. you know, it could be the worst day of your life or it could be the best day. And now it's, you so make it the, you I make, make it, it the best, best day and I celebrate it. And I also started my business on October 10th, 2015. So we're just going to keep <laughs> so the good things coming good on 1010 right. from and here on out. No accident we're on today at 1010. How we about the that? Tens. How about that? Fabulous thing. So, and you're showing us how to make a healthier version of a drink that we all love. Yes, we do love. But... Do you know how much sugar is in your coffee shop pumpkin spice latte? Honestly, that's why I try not to drink them because I don't know and I know there's a ton. Are you about to show us how much sugar? That's how much sugar? Would you ever pour put, that in and let's see. Would you ever put this much sugar in your <gasps> coffee? No wonder they taste so good. I know. I know. <laughs> right? Sugar, sugar's delicious and it's addicting. That is way too much. Yeah, so you're thinking, what's the big deal, Vivian? What's the big deal about sugar, right? Well, it's not good, I know that. It's not good, it causes inflammation, which causes disease. So that's why we try to stay away from this. And we have a healthier version today. Thank you for doing this for us. <laughs> sure. Swapping out the old stuff, bringing yes. in this. That's what I like to so do. So how do you make it? Super easy. So we're gonna start with coconut milk, and we're going to the stove here. We're gonna try to turn it on. See, I love how everyone knows. <laughs> we're gonna try to turn it <laughs> on. And we're, do you like it, you did it iced or hot? You know what? I would do it either way. We're doing hot today. Okay. So you don't get a choice. I don't. <laughs> but if you wanted it iced, just put this in the refrigerator. Okay. And make it cold. So, so you don't have to heat it up then if you want this to be an iced drink. Correct. Okay. Yes. So while this is heating, and I think this is going to heat pretty quickly. Let that We are going to put our other ingredients in the blender. Okay. So we just need two tablespoons of real pumpkin. And when you're shopping for pumpkin, uh, you want pure pumpkin puree. So you don't want pumpkin pie filling because that has sugar and spices and stuff in it. Just pure. So that won't have much. That won't taste sweet at all, really. No, no, it just tastes like it's good for you. Pumpkin smell. Yep, it tastes yeah, like you're just carving a pumpkin. But it's it really out. good for you. It's got lots of vitamins and minerals. In okay. It. And so also, that's one. so you've opened up this big old can of pumpkin. Now, what are you going to do? You know what I do with it? What do you do? I give it to my dog. So good. I was going so, to mention that it's good for dogs, so too. So good for the dog's digestion. I'm not a veterinarian, so. But I've not, heard that so many it, times. It's so good for them. All right, that's the ingredient one. So, what about ingredient what's, one? What's next? Now we want a tablespoon of syrup, and you know I don't measure. So we're just going to put a tablespoon of maple syrup. And use, that looked like a good measurement to me. Yeah. And this is where you can adjust. If you like it really sweet, put two tablespoons in. And you want 100% pure maple syrup. Not pancake syrup. Very different. Very, very different animal. So we want um, pure maple syrup. And then we want, this is so easy, a quarter teaspoon of pumpkin spice, uh, pumpkin pie spice. Yeah. So we're just going to put a little bit of that in. Okay. And then a quarter teaspoon of our vanilla. I love the smell of vanilla, too. I do, too. And, you know, just a tiny bit. So, so far, I can and see this is a very different type of drink. Very, very different. And then, of course, you need some coffee in there. And I found these little sticks of coffee that you can buy all over the place now. They're right in the coffee see, section. See, since I don't drink coffee, I had no idea. There's a lot of folks out there who probably say, of course, I know Of them. course, of course. So you just pour that right in. Throw it in. So you can do this. This is so easy. Okay. And now we're probably burning up our coconut milk. Mm. We're just going to drop that in here. Oh, this looks like it's going to be delicious. See? So there How did is, you come up with the recipe? I actually found it on the internet. Okay. One of my favorite doctors that I follow makes this. So we are gonna, now whenever you're doing something hot in your blender, you wanna take out 
the top because you don't want the steam building up in an explosion. I mean, that would be that would be great really TV. bad. <laughs> Not but today. we don't want to burn Not you. Today. <laughs> so I put a towel on top, and then we're going to get her going. Go. Just blend her up, and that's it. So this would probably, would this serve one or two? This, would... this serves, well, it's a can of coconut milk, so it serves two. Okay. These are pretty small glasses, but. I'm glad we got the sugar out. Yes. <laughs> and, all right. all right, here's the hard that's part. That's the hardest part, is just trying to get the top off of the Vitamix. All right, my Vitamix and is And I don't own one, so I don't know how to help you right now. David does, so he, uh, there you oh. go. You can just manhandle it. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Now I use decaf coffee. You can use decaf, you can use regular. You can use the bottom of the um, coffee pot. It's only a quarter cup of coffee. So if you happen to have leftover coffee from your morning coffee, you can use that. I never have leftover. So that's of course why, you don't. That's because why it tastes oh it so tastes good. It tastes so good. That's why I found these so little sticks. Remind everyone as I take my sip. Ten 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 coach. You they can find you on your website. On my website, ten 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 coach dot com. And they can consult with you. Yes. You, that's how they get started with everything, right? Yes. And yes. you can coach them in all areas. Any health areas. Mm -hmm. Which yes. she's the health expert. Cheers to yes. you. Thank, Thank you for coming. And cheers Thank to you. this anniversary and Thank making you. it, as you say, something positive to think about. Mm -hmm. So I will, I will cheers for that. All right. What do you think? Mm. I could tell from the moment I sipped it. I actually think this is better than the coffee shop one. Listen, folks, switch it out. It's good for you. And it, that tastes unbelievable. You might get me drinking coffee right now. Huh? I might just do it. See? David, I'll send it over to you. And I'm you know what? And if you don't like coffee, you just skip the coffee part. There you go. Yeah, you still win, win your for all. Spice. Spice. Yep. If I don't right. want the coffee, I'll just switch it to the non-coffee right. form.